Hey guys, welcome to Cody's Cowboy Hats. It's a hat tip Thursday. And uh, for this week, we're gonna shape one up for you for the tip. And uh, uh, this is a customer's hat. We had, a, had him blow it out for it for him and then uh, flatten the brim, start over. Um, what he's wanting is more of like a, just a slightly sloped uh, cattleman's crown uh, J, uh, with a JB brim. So uh, we'll get started on that and I'll kind of walk you through each process, each step. So. Um, well, let's get started. So go ahead and want to heat it up. So get it hot. I already have center marked. Go ahead and put that top initial crease in it. Like I said, we're just going to be a slightly sloped to the front cattleman crown. you're straight with your mark and then with the side dance you can kind of see it's slightly sloped there we're gonna push the the side dance a little bit closer to the front Kind of like that, see that? A little bit more towards the front there. Same thing on the other side. Similar to that right there. And then, like I said, it's gonna be a JV brim, but it's gonna be just a little bit more narrow in the front um, than a normal JV. Heat up the brim pretty good. Okay, find your center. Kind of bring it down in the front. This is how I do it anyway. Uh, different hat shapers have different ways of doing it. Kind of get it started there, like that. So the hat's going to go the direction that you hit the steam on. So if you hit it on the bottom, it's going to move away from the steam. Good sharp corners. Same thing on the other side. Got the kind of that initial crease there. Steam it underneath again, and just kind of put your hand on the inside there like that. Just kind of pull, pull the front of that down so you kind of pull it from the brim or from the crown there. They have a nice easy slope coming right off the crown. finish straightening that out in the front make sure everything's straight just kind of like that Kind of roll the back just a little more. It's kind of flat right now than what he, what, than what he wants. So we'll kind of roll that up a little more. Uh, just like I said last time, if you'll hit it on the bottom, that steam will push that whole thing up a little. Bit. 
And what I like to do is use the table, you know, just like you're gonna crease the front kind of, but then just slide that off to the edge a little bit like that and just kind of roll that around like that. That'll bring that back up a little bit. And you kind of straighten it by hand. Everything looks good. And that's pretty well done. We'll straighten up the front. Sit on there like that. Just kind of rub your fingers right across the front of that on your table. Just like that. everything straight just like that we're done so like I said it's a little bit it's not quite a gust but it's just a little bit more sloped in the front um, and then pulling those uh, side dents closer to the front and then like I said there on the brim so that's finished like there um, all it takes is a little bit of practice. If you're, if you're looking to do a certain crease, just try it. If not, you know, get you some plates, some balloons, blow it back out, start over. Um, you know, and that's all. You know, that's really all you can do is just keep keep practicing uh, your shapes. Um, so that's all we have for you this week, and uh, we'll see you next week, Thursday. We we'll have another uh, tip for you. If you have, if you guys have any questions, let us know. Um, if you have any suggestions on what um, hat tips uh, we should do, I know we've gotten a lot uh, here lately and we're going to try to work all those in, but uh, if there's any other ones you can think of, let us know and we'll try to fit those in as well. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next week.